I'm gonna get you, Metal Medley! Ah, oh, I missed him. Ah, oh, bugger off, Rogue Hunter Mech. And anyway, guys, welcome back. Let's play Dragon Quest IX, the Sentinels of the Starry Skies. In the last episode, we made it to the Bad Cave. Because we are bad. We know it. Aha. Uh -huh. Anyway. Ooh, Metal Medley. Hello. Well, Metal Medleys aren't as rare as I thought they were, it looks like. That's a good thing, actually, because Metal Medleys are... Well, they're really good for uh, just sort of killing purposes. So... And for experience purposes, so the more we find, the better we're gonna be. Because metal medleys give so much experience, as you've seen already in the last episode. Yeah, and flaming nails is really gonna help here. Flaming nails! Oh yeah, two damage. Oh, and then he runs away like a wuss. Wuss! 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 Anyway, forget it. He's a wuss. It's no use. Let's carry on though. Ah, Hunter Mech. You're not as good as a Metal Medley. Metal Medleys are awesome. You are not. Hey, you're dead. Hoorah. All right. So X and Marissa are both at the same level. Uh, Mastrath and Jade are just behind. And there's a Father Magic Water. That's nice. All right, let's keep going. To the Bad Cave. Ooh. Hey, it's Marionette! Wonder what we're gonna do here? Well, let's heal just in case. Because I know what happens next. And it's not nice. Is there any... Is there anything over here? No. Alright, let's have a chat with Marionette. Where did you run off to? Marionette? Oh, hello. M Marionette? How do you know my real name? I've made some charming new friends. One of them has a beard, and the other one has a mask and is called Gov. Only, I wasn't having much fun playing with them, so I decided to go for a walk. Are you on a walk too? What the hell's that? Oh, hello. Who are you? Oh, God. Is that the... That's the Tyrantula, isn't it? Hitchy. Hitchy indeed. Hitchy. Nice to meet you, too. You're very interesting looking, aren't you? Will you be my friend? Ho he! Ho he indeed! Oh, God! That's bad. Um, uh, are you okay, Marionette? Marionette does not doesn't so much as twitch. Oh, for God's sake, not another death in the game. It's just a toy, but... Ugh, fine. Tarantula, you're gonna pay for that. You hitchy, whatever, you're gonna die. Die! Die at the hands of my team. Die. I like that word. Die. Alright, so let's kick off with... Uh, hmm. Oh, yeah, Helm Splitter, of course. Helm Splitter. Flaming Nails. See, if I had something to kill off insects, that'd be good, but I don't, sadly. Buff just raises one. Okay, I might as well just go for the attack with everyone. There's one hit. Flaming Nails! No, not bad damage. And now me. Fire. Yes. Eerie Light. Oh, no. Our resistance to adverse effects. Ow. Bugger you. So Tarantula can attack twice. That's okay, I guess. Anyway, we're getting some damage off, which is good. We just need to keep up the attack. More flaming nails. Nope, oh, goes to the attack. Hits Jade for damage. And then hits X for very little damage, because X is a badass. Damage. More damage. Oh, critical hit to the face. So luckily Tarantula hasn't got much health. He's got something like 1.3 thousand. 1,300, not bad. So if we can keep up this tactic we've got at the moment, we could do well. Right, so now all he's going to do is attack Marissa. He goes for the Wicked Web. I block the attack with my shield. And now the Venom Missile. Ow. Not so good. His rage has subsided now, so he can attack everyone. 
Let's attack though. Me! Fire! And then X. Helm Splitter! Alright, let's keep up the attack. Let's keep up the assault. I'm gonna mid heal my. Uh, Jade's gonna mid heal herself. Flaming Nails! 35 points of damage, wow, that's nothing. I've got the Winsicles. Ay, that's not good. Well, then X takes some damage there. That's okay. Now it's my turn. Yeah, and now mid heal. Jade, back to pretty much full health. Right, so we're all in quite good health at the moment. Ah, defense goes down a lot. That's a good thing. But I might as well keep going for Helm Splitter just in case. Next, I'm going to mid heal me, I think. Flaming Nails! 99 points of damage. Very well done. Ah! Marissa takes some damage there. Wicked Web on Jada. No, Jada! Or oh, Jade, damn it! Die! Meet my Helm Splitting Axe! Oh! He died! He died! He died! So that was that, that was that was quite a good uh, opponent there. Quite quite an easy battle there. Hey, Mashrath Guru is level twenty-two. Nice. And learns mid heal. Lovely. Now we have two mid healing people. Jade grew to level twenty-two as well. And learns tingle. Hooray! Anyway, Tarantula drops at, uh, the chest and it's got a tangle web in it. Nice. Die, Tyrantula! You are no match for us! Oi, miss! Oh, it's Gov and the other guy. M miss Uh, yeah, she's dead, mate. Pull yourself together, love! Come on! She's dead, mate. Oh, crikey! She's a goner! Watch it, Gav! Wait, no, she's up! Oh, dearie me, what a shock! Ah, uh, uh, you're ain't you supposed to be dead? Th this place is haunted. I'm getting out of here. Help! There's a monster in here. Help! Help! A monster? Yeah, don't worry. We killed it though. Monsters are those nasty creatures that no one ever likes in storybooks. I understand now. I suppose I always knew deep down. I'm sorry, Marion, but I'm just no good at being mortal. All these people aren't really my friends. They only like me for things I give them. I've tried, Marion, for your sake, but I'll never be able to make true friends. I'm just a monster. No, they were talking about the tarantula, of course. You are no monster. You are my one true friend. My best friend, Marionette. Hey, it's Marion! You're back! Did you go somewhere nice? Let's play! What do you want to play? Well, at the moment I'm playing Dragon Quest IX, we could play that! That's an idea! I'm sorry, Marionette. We can't play anymore. We can't play ever again. Don't you like me anymore? Is that why you don't want to play with me? I was all alone in this world, Marionette. You were the only one who kept me going, but now... Now you are all alone. Alone? You brought me such happiness, I... I... Happiness, yes. I'm always happy when I'm with you, Marion. I'm so sorry. Be free now, Marionette. Forget about my dying wish. Just be free. I am Marion. You are Marionette. I have to go far, far away. The Celestrians are coming to take me. Don't pretend to be me anymore. You are marionette. Go back to being a doll now. Thank you, marionette. Thank you, my one true friend. May you find happiness. By the way, why aren't we getting benevolence anymore? You know, the Twitter icons. Why aren't we getting any of them anymore? Marin has gone a long journey, so I must go back to being a doll. But first, I must tell everyone that Marion's going away. Okay. So, more lying. No one will ever know about it, will they? No one is ever going to know that Marion's actually dead, are they? No one will ever know about it. 
Well, let's zoom back to Bloomingdale. So, we have beaten another boss, but there was no fig. Hmm, I wonder why. Well, maybe if we go back to the Bloomingdale Mansion, maybe we'll find out. Also, will we actually get that ship? Let's find that out as well. Marionette! Oh, the door's open. That's cool. And this one's open as well. Ah! There's Marionette. There's a doll by the grave. Ah, so she looks it looks like she turned back into a doll. Hey, the fig! There you go! And we obtained fig number four! Just three to go now. We're over halfway through the, 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 the fig stage of the game. There it is. Have it in Marion, have Marion's doll and get up, end up here. Come along, Marionette. Let's get you back to Marion's bedroom so you'll be there when she comes home. Ask the old woman. Let her come home, blah, blah, blah. Change voice. And she just drags Marionette. Drag her. Oh, yes, Mr. Bastrath. Yes? Marion wanted you to know that you could have her ship. Apparently the ship's warden is waiting for you on the jetty. He's abreast of the situation too. Goodbye then, dear. Goodbye, indeed. Wait a minute, there's a dog here. What are you doing here? Mm-mm. What's a random dog in this weird gravesite? Just a random dog. The doll just sits here, lifelessly. Ah, well there you go, the little madam has turned back into a doll. The little madam has turned back into a right doll, you could say. Anyway. That is it, that is fig number four, and we get our ship. We've gotten the SS Blo the Pride of Bloomingdale. Nice. Anyway, first, let's buy some stuff. Oh, look at this lovely stuff we can get. Look at all this lovely stuff we could get. Look at this. Look at all this. But for the moment, I think we need more armor. Armor's more our thing that we need, because the weapons can wait for the moment. The weapons can wait. So what do we got here? Ah, some platinum shields. They will be useful. Cat ears? Maybe? I don't know. Well, we'll buy one of them. If so, just to give it to Marissa so she has more defense. She doesn't need Magical Might and Mending, but it's a defensive purpose, so that's good. Uh, Spangled Dress? That just gives defense. Ah, uh, might as well use it. Get a Spangled Dress for Jade. Jade's definitely the weakest member of the team at the moment, but then again, I'm not surprised. The priests usually are. And some Tussler's Trousers, why not? And that's gonna go to... I believe, yep, they go to Marissa. There you go, so now, some of my team has had a complete overhaul. Uh, I look no different, by the way, because I'm a, I'm me. It's all the way it is. All right, let's have a check to see if there are any shoes we can get. Yo, what's up? Yep, you're a master cobbler. I call cobblers on that, buddy. Yep, frugal footwear. Okay, you've already got sh sh la la la, the shoes. Anyway, Kung Fu shoes, might as well get them. Uh, 3% evasiveness chance. That's good. May help out in time. Anyway, that's all our money spent, so yeah. Let's just, actually, before we check our team, I'm breaking all your pots and your barrels and stuff. Alright, so let's see what we look like at the moment. We've got me, looking quite good, quite dapper. X with his mask of awesomeness. And we've got Marissa with her cat ears. And lastly, Jade with her nice dress and sheepskin boots. I don't know. Anyway. What do we want at the moment when it comes to... Ah. Uh, no, I guess we could do with a bit of a... Uh, a bit of a heal. But for the moment, I'm just going to ordinary heal. I think that'll work for the moment. I mean, we're not going to be on the ship for that long before we have to go somewhere else. So that's alright. Right, let's go to the ship. Wrong way. But let's go to the ship again. Different way. 
We will be back to get ourselves some black platinum shields and the weapons we need. But for the moment, we're just going to be here. Yo, hey, buddy. There you are. I've been waiting for you. I expect you've been busy being showered with gratitude by Mrs. Bloom, have you? Really? You didn't find her before she left on her journey? She's a standoffish one, all right. That young lady. She could have at least thanked you for rescuing her before heading off. Anyway, as promised, this old vessel is yours now. To sail on wherever you please. Take her far and wide. She likes to travel, this one. Well, get out of the way and I can. Go on then, climb aboard. There's a fine wind today. You wouldn't want to waste it. Also, he looks like Eren's granddad as well. Anyway. Have a safe journey, lad. I'll be praying for you. And we're off. We know how to ru we know how to drive a ship or sail a ship. Awesome. We acquire a ship. The biggest item in our inventory. <laughs> if it comes up in our inventory and it says ship, that should be hilarious. Yay, we've blagged ourselves a lot. Uh, we've blagged ourselves a boat at last. Let's set sail and see what we can see. Other than the sea, if you see what I mean. Oh, if you want to see everything ship shapes and mitts while we're sailing, just press the B button to hit the deck, okay? When you're ready to get going again, press the A button next to the steering wheel on the deck, and it's anchors away. If you want to get off, just steer straight for shore with a the, with the control pad, and you'll be able to walk the plank to dry land. And once you're off on the boat, you'll be able to see what it is on the map. If you, if you can't find it, hit the Y button. Right. That's the Sailing 101 course done and dusted with. Let's scar across the seas till we're sea sore. I'll soar across the seas, okay. Well first, I'm going to switch to the inside of the boat and see what we've got. Yes! My own ship with my team of awesome people. Ah, money. Nice. Might as well go down here, see what we've got. I like this music. I think this music's quite cool. I like it. This is the cabin. With some stuff in it. Oh, wait, was that a bookcase over there? That was a bookcase. There's a book called On the Crest of a Wave. Seashells and Crimson Coral. Nice. Father Recipe to the Trident. Grey Coast Trident. Water Mall Wand. Nice. Pretty much some water related stuff. That's quite cool. I like it. Do, 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 do. All right, let's see. Uh, the only way that's left is this over here. There's barrels in here. Let's break these up. I am the captain. Let me sit in the seat. Damn it. Let me sit in the seat. I'm the captain. I am the captain. I am Captain Mastrath of SSS Rusty and Crud. SSS Ringworm. That's, no, Woodworm. That's what it's called. SSS Woodworm. Anyway. Let us set sail. We could disembark by just pushing towards a bit of land. And now we are somewhere over here. With more enemies. Enemies we've seen before. Let's have a look at this lighthouse though. There's a bunny girl here. Oh yes, yes, this is this and this. And pop that on there. And whippy, perfection. But, oh no. I've popped that on the place that then. Whippy back, um, tricky. Yeah, whatever. I'm so tired from searching for the for the grotto marked in this treasure map. I can barely move. Where could it be? Oh, yeah, the treasure maps. They show the entrances of grottos. Where you can find all kinds of amazing treasure. If you've got one, you can take a look at it by selecting treasure maps from the items section of the menu. Pick a map and go and then select let, go treasure hunting. And it'll appear on the top screen. Then it's off to the find the grotto it shows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There are some really tough bosses. Yep. I need rest. Okay, that's pretty much telling you about grottos, and grottos is a 
a place where you can find some really good stuff. I may show off a grotto in, a, in an extra part, but for the moment, I'm not going to be using any grottos. Anyway, I'm going to go for a break here, but I'll see you back in the next part. Let's play Dragon Quest IX Sentinels of the Starry Skies, where it's ship time. I'll see you then.